What's going on, you guys? It is the first show day of the year. So we're at the Houston Tournament of Champions here in the Woodlands, Texas. So we're at the venue right now. The show is just getting started. They just wrapped up with bodybuilding. Um, so it's like Christmas for me. So this is like where the fun starts beginning. Um, so I only have four doing this show to, to start off the year, but um, not a huge show, but I'm really excited to see how they look. Um, they all look really awesome. They've all made a lot of progress since the beginning of their prep. Um, and I'm hoping that all of them come away with a placing, some trophies, some hardware. The event gets kind of loud, so. Um, but like I said, everyone's looking good. I'm excited to kind of show you guys what I do backstage. Me and Peter both got a backstage pass. I'm going to be pumping up the athletes. Going to be kind of going through the whole show day process. Uh, give you guys a little sneak peek of what a show day is like before my own show day in a couple of weeks. So um, it is Saturday. I'm currently 11 weeks out from Junior Nationals in Chattanooga. Um, our flight and everything is booked for that. So that is like now kind of the next target after this. Um, and we're gonna see how the rest of show day goes. We have a booth set up for the gym. So a lot of cool stuff going on. So I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride. Enjoy. All right, so my food man, Nick is doing the show. I don't coach him or anything, but he's a little flat. So I'm gonna try and help him out, make sure he's all taken care of. A little bit of that, like probably half of it. Mm -hmm. A little more back. Yeah, that ready. Seventy-six. Right. Right. Yeah. Guess we gotta work.
got an impromptu pump up, so that's kind of cool. So Nick, none of my people have actually gone on yet, so Nick will be the first guy that I kind of know that's doing the show. So um, like I said, he was a little bit flat, so his metabolism has been on fire. Like I think yesterday he said he had like two burgers, two orders of fries, and like two cookies. And then he was still kind of a little bit flat, so a good problem to have, but sometimes like if food doesn't stick to you, it's, it's kind of, it can be a, it can be an issue because you can get kind of distended. So um, I'll have Peter take some clips of him, like you know, doing his routine, and everything on stage, and we'll see how he looks. Next up is competitor number one seventy six, Nick Anderson. Turn your side towards me a little bit. There. I right, do it again. Do the whole thing again. But just make sure on that front pose you're, you're facing. Think. If your hips are here, just think about bringing that belly button a little more here, okay? There you go, good. Can you do that pose again? Just bring this hand a little more. There you go, so I can see those abs. So it's not like punching Yeah, exactly. So I want you, instead of here, just come here. There you go, good. Don't want to see those abs. Good, there you go. Good transition. Just, yeah, with you, like, not like right now, but like, do you have food with you, packed with you? Yeah. Okay. Do you have any candy? Uh, like Reese's or anything? Yes, okay. I have something similar to Reese's. Okay. Like a butter Okay. I have Reese's. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Let me go. Do you have peanut butter or almond butter? Yeah, I have almond butter and then uh, the BB too. 
So you said you have a Butterfinger? What kind of candy do you have? Uh, I have that uh, Quest Buttercup. I don't want the Quest because that has too much fiber. I'm going to have you snag. Okay. Thank you. I'm seeing it. Oh, that's good. Okay, one, two. Good. One more that way. There you go, good. Thank you, good. Open it up. Good. Two, good. Back. Good. One more that way. There you go. Good. Very nice. Time right, how do you eat again? Nothing crazy. Run through it one more time. What kind of candy do you have with you? What's up? What kind of candy do you have? You have Reese's? Reese's candy. Okay. Yeah. I'm starting to get a Reese's. Yeah. Uh, yes. no. <laughs> so I'm gonna have you eat the Reese's now. That way it doesn't get you too late. That way you can use it when yeah. you pump up. Uh, Let's see it. Where's the right direction? Do it. Go through a thousand directions. Yeah, we'll do it that one this time. Mm -hmm. They're coming out on the left, right? Yeah, uh, yes. Back left, yeah. Lean back a little bit, dump your chest. There. Don't worry about it right now, because I'm having to do three ounces of chicken. Routine look okay? Better? Yeah, much better. Okay. Alright, so go ahead and count that. No, that way, that way more. Bring that arm. Let it be shut. There you go, much better. So, yeah, don't, don't open up too much. Yeah, much better. Just let it flow, just let it hang. Some chest. There you go, good. We're all in good. All right, we're looking good. I sent them all their adjustments. So at this point in a show, we're adjusting literally every hour. So they've been sending me a check-in pretty much every hour, uh, like on the hour. Um, I just sent them some adjustments. The show, like I said earlier, is a little bit smaller than I thought. So we're kind of trying to get some food in now. That way, um, you know, they're not distended or anything whenever they actually go on stage. So they took a little intermission real quick. And then I believe they're going to do, um, they saw figure and then wellness, we will be doing wellness. And then after that, we have Eddie and Chris are gonna do physique. 
and then Anne will be doing bikini very last. So um, we're on a good track right now, so I'm hoping that you know we collect some trophies and everyone does great. So um, I think the next clip will be us pumping up um, backstage and then everyone doing their thing on stage. So stay tuned. <laughs> Getting yelled at for leaving my fucking goldfish everywhere. It's a hard life, bro. Man! So Brady's about to go on for novice. Pumping the guys up. Anna's chilling right now. So we're gonna see how Bree does in a second. Okay, ladies, quarter turn to your right. Quarter turn face the back. One more time. Hey Chris, they got some in there. Where's bring one for mom? Okay. $20. Second hold on. I see 20 and I'll hold on this one. There you go, good.
is done. I have Eddie and Chris are about to go on, so they're starting the Masters. The Masters class is pretty good. Uh, there's 10 of them. It's really competitive, especially for Masters. So we're going to try and ink out a win here. And then Eddie is doing True Novice, or not True Novice, uh, just regular Novice. I believe class C or D. Um, so fingers crossed we're going to get a win, and then we have Anne, and then we're done for pre-judging. Okay, gentlemen, if I can have you face the back. Face front. Face Great job, guys. You're going to exit stage right, and we'll see you do your individual short. Watch one through the show. Don't judge Okay, gentlemen, if I can have you face the back. Don't that set. That's money, Chris. Good. Face front. Show the judges. Show the judges. Gentlemen, please don't cover your numbers. If you can make sure that your numbers are visible to the judges. Thank you. Okay, Tom.
keep on doing those side raises and keep doing those bicep curls because I want you feeling out a little bit more here too, okay? Um, I feel like my, uh, my shoulder is a little bit more. Yeah, you guys keep on pumping up the shoulders. So you can take like dumbbells, do dumbbell or band. How about my clear? They're, they're good. Um, I don't want you to get too full in the hamstrings. I'd rather you see like the lines versus the full. So I just want this to fill out more than anything. Okay. Just pump it up. Do it? Just pump it up. Just pump those up, yeah. <laughs> Still do a couple bicep curls throughout. <laughs> Take waves whenever it's um, whenever it's novice class A going on. I already glazed. Do it again. Do it again because you're still you're soaking up a little bit here. So have them do your midsection and your legs. It's so like your glutes, your quads, and your your midsection. Your your arms are kind of glazed still, but you're you're soaking that up here. So let's have them do it again once once everyone's A starts. Okay. All right. But I think that's it for now. So one more person going on. All the guys have gone. Bria and the guys have gone. Um, so we have Anne doing open bikini D and novice bikini D. After those two, we're out of here. So hopefully we can get some footage of Anne. Um, we have some people trying to spoil the party and get mad that we have a camera in here. But if that's the case, then they're going to have to get mad at every single person here. Because every single person here brings a camera. So NPC, if you're watching this, a lot of people bring in their cameras. Come on. But one more class and then we're done. So we just wrapped up pre-judging. Uh, the pros are about to go on. Frankly, I might watch it, I might not. Um, but everyone did pretty well, so I'm uh, just writing what they are about to eat. 
Um, and it's only 1.30, so I'm probably gonna go back to our side of town. Um, I still need to lift, cardio, do all the things. So after that, um, I'm gonna bring it back here for the night show, see how everyone did, um, and then kind of game plan for future shows. Eddie's about to do another show in a couple weeks, as is Bree. Uh, and then I know Ann wants to do one later in the year. And then Chris is gonna do Masters Nationals later in the year. So all four of these guys uh, aren't done yet. So it's just step one in this whole kind of season that we're about to go under. So see you guys at the night show and I'll tell you how everyone did. All right, so we have made it to the night show. Uh, so I just handed out some awards. Um, so we had like a little bicep curl competition and then I was actually able to hand out the first place check to the Tournament Champions IFBB Pro winner. Uh, so it was actually a buddy of mine, Kali, so he qualified for the 2021 Mr. Olympia contest. So that's kind of cool being able to hand him the check. So now we're going through all of the kind of awards, the posing routines, everything like that. Um, so we're just kind of waiting to see how everyone placed, see how everyone landed. Um, and then from there, that's gonna be a wrap. So hope you guys enjoyed kind of some insight on um, what it's like on a little bit of a show day and I hope it makes you guys excited to watch mine in 11 weeks so appreciate you guys for watching and I appreciate the love see you guys in the next one our other competitors tonight we got two great teams two great winners some sexy and second place number 140 Brianna Ramsey which makes first place Brittany Bolton Number 146, Brittany Bolton. And first place, number 139, Stephanie Middleton. And first place, Rochelle Morris. Step into the box there, that lighting is perfect right there. Perfect, thank you. Congratulations, ladies. Michelle, go set that thing down. Get ready to duke it out for that overall title. All right, show is a wrap. Um, all of my people are done. I think they're doing the overall for the bikini right now. So um, everyone did really well. Uh, really happy for everyone. Everyone definitely brought their best. Uh, I had two newbies go on for the first time, and then I had two clients that have improved on their uh, previous packages. So as a coach, that, they did all I could ask for. So I'm super happy with all of them. Um, you know, we all got some placings, which is good to add to the resume, add to the team, especially for the first show out the gate. Uh, so that's always good. So now uh, we're just packing up the booth, and then it's onward to the Phil Heath Classic uh, in three weeks. Um, so that was in College Station. I only have three doing that one. And then I have a little bit of a break where I can focus on my shows. Um, and then the next one I have, client-wise, is going to be the Branch Warren Classic. And that will be in June, I believe. Uh, I have five or six doing that show. And then the Lee Labrada Classic in July where I have 10 or 11. So a lot more competing in show days in the future. So this is just the start of a really hectic year. So. Uh, man, I love it. It's my favorite time of year. So, um, really happy with everyone. It's a really long day, but it's a really rewarding day. It's a good day. You know, seeing everyone getting like some cookies and some food afterwards makes me ready for me to get ready and uh, you know, kind of enjoy that same experience. Get the tan. You know, kind of pump up, carve up, deplete, all that fun stuff. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of a, a backstage kind of insight to the vid like to the competition world. Um, I want to thank John Sherman and his wife Virginia Sherman, the, the promoters of this show, the Houston Tournament of Champions for uh, allowing me and Peter backstage with my clients, um, allowing us to record everything, pictures, you know, the whole nine yards. Uh, I really do appreciate it. Um, you know, it is not often that we can kind of get this like first real like kind of documentary style insight into a show. So like I said, it's, it's a big honor um, and I appreciate them for letting us do that and having us and, um, you know, letting us hand out awards. So overall it's a really cool experience. So 
Uh, appreciate you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. 11 weeks out. Let's get it done. I'll see you on the next one.